We have Japan stressing concern, fearing that Russia is going to continue to build up in these disputed islands that Russia and Japan have been fighting over for a long time. And for those that do not know, these two countries never did sign a peace treaty or a pact at the end of World War II. Okay, these two countries are sitting on opposite sides of the spectrum here, so to speak. You have China and Japan that don't see eye to eye. They have been fighting over islands. Well, China's been fighting with many different countries over the South China Sea, the rim of it. But Russia's just like right there with them. Like, look, between you and us, we're going to try to snatch up and claim all this different territory. Anyone wants to say anything about it, what are they going to do? It's kind of like the same situation here on the, on the world stage with the U.S. dollar. The United States went around the globe, country to country, and enforced using that dollar at the barrel of a gun. All the way up to Libya. But when it comes to China entering into the IMF basket, the world currency, with their Chinese yuan, and backing it with oil and gold, Russia, right there with them. See, the United States can't go and by force the barrel of a gun. The closest thing they can do to it is wage these proxies, which they've been doing, which you've seen erupt in all these other countries. Specifically, Ukraine has been a huge one. And Crimea involved there. Now look at what's going on in Syria. So when it comes down to these other little territories, you have to pay attention because it seems to me that Russia and China are going to make moves on them. This disputed island region is called the Kuril Islands by Russia or the Northern Territories by Japan. So it's interesting to note the history here that this is still ongoing and we'll just have to see where it goes from here. But I wanted to make mention of it. If we see any movement on these islands, any adding to with military equipment, anything like that, I'll make sure to update. I'll leave a link below. It's been Dabu7.